The University of KwaZulu-Natal's College of Agriculture, Engineering and Science offers an exceptionally wide range of exciting and innovative courses that will broaden your horizons and allow critical thinking while enhancing your career opportunities. In 2017, UKZN was ranked in the top three universities in South Africa, making it a prime choice for many students. While all the courses have a minimum entry requirement, applicants from disadvantaged backgrounds and those who do not meet the normal entry requirements may be considered for admission to the college through one of the access programs. The Science and Engineering Access Program is an alternative entry route for students from previously disadvantaged backgrounds who do not meet the normal entry requirements into university. You might not have got the marks required to enter directly into a mainstream program, a bachelor's degree, so you enter into the access program where instead you do first year over two years. So for example, uh, maths one, you do it over two years. The first year would be semester one and the second, second year would be semester two. The access program, as I said, is not a standalone program. It leads into your degree of choice. So in engineering, for example, you would take your engineering first year and split it over two years. In your third year of study, you would be able to take your full second year of engineering. So that is in itself saying that you are already a student in the engineering program. However, we just allow you to take your first year at a slower pace so that you can uh, develop the skills needed to cope with the rigors of a engineering in mainstream. The science access program is exactly the same and we allow you to take your first year over a period of two years. Um, during that two years you gain the skills needed to enter into any mainstream program within the college. What we also do is we expose you to a lot of uh, the soft skills which are basically study techniques, how to go about studying, how to organize yourself and um, you get a lot of support from tutors from the lectures themselves, right? from other students, from past students. The Access program is very successful at UKZN. We have a history of excellence within our Access program. Our students are well poised to enter the, mar the job market as well as to enter postgraduate studies. In fact, a number of our students have gone on to graduate uh, with masters and PhD degrees. We have a number of students who've ended up in top positions within government, uh, within the research and development industries and our student success speaks for itself. In the Access program, students are given extra tuition in the first two years where they are separated from the mainstream lectures, tutorials and practicals. The content and expected outcomes are the same for the mainstream and Access program, however, Students in the Access program are supplemented with additional lectures, practical sessions and small group tutorials. Many students that go through the Access program end up pursuing postgraduate studies in many disciplines. My name is Mzungiz Mtembo. I'm a PhD student in Physics at University of Washington Natal. I'm the graduate from Access program. Doing Access program was one of the amazing things that ever happened in my life. Reason being, firstly, when I was I was coming from the disadvantaged background, where I was from the rural area, where I was no elite, I didn't know more about what is offering at the University of Western Natal. So, access program gave me that chance and opportunity to experience the environment, and the, the staff were so supportive, such that you will then discover what really you want to do. Because I didn't know much about physics, I only know that you can. After you're doing science at high school, you can become a doctor, but access program gave me that chance and that opportunity to really find myself. So the experience was good. Students who qualify to the enter the access program are predominantly students from the quintiles one to three schools, which are the previously disadvantaged schools, uh, schools in the rural areas which receive no support from government or very little support and where resources are lacking. Students generally from these schools meet academic potential, however, did not perform to their best because of their poor schooling environment. In order to qualify for entry into the Access program, applicants should have a full NSC qualification with at least 26 points, excluding life orientation, and should have obtained a level 3 in mathematics and a level 3 in physical science or life science or agricultural science. Visit our website for more information.